What's going on guys and welcome back to another episode of That's Not My Neighbor. Last we left off we completed day four and we are on to day five. I believe we haven't killed anyone yet so I'm trying to go for the perfect run here. So we're going to continue with day five. Let's go. Tomorrow's the weekend. Yep. We still have work to do. All right. Those monsters don't rest and neither does the DDD. Okay. Today's list. All right. We've got six people today. All right. Who's first? Hello, milkman. You are on the list. Let me just take a look at what you have real quick. Um, okay, Francis Moses. Let's look at the ID real quick. You're the third floor, right? Okay, you're this one. Okay. So, Milkman, 2355, 2355, 6941, 6941, 8995, 8995. All right, that's good. The date looks good. The logo looks good. You come from your job as a mailman. Or Milkman, not mailman. <laughs> uh, all right. Second, third room on the second floor, or second room on the third floor. All right, let me look at your appearance. Long nose, yep, that's correct. Thin chin, mm-hmm. Short hair, tired eyes, yep. And where's a hat? Hold on. He has a mole. Um. Let me question that. <laughs> You have a mole on your face. Yeah. I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to have a mole on the, the what's that, the left side of your eye and whatever. Let me just make a quick phone call. He had a mole on the left side of his face. Yeah, I'm, Francis doesn't have a mole. So that was the first doppelganger right off the bat. All right. All right, we'll see if he appears again. Hey, how you doing? You are on the list, it looks like. Let me see, the logo looks good, the date looks good. Let me check this, the ID number. 5685... Five six eight five five four five nine five four five nine six three two nine six three two nine. So yeah, that's good. We got that going. All right, let me look at your appearance. Long face. Yep, that looks good. Big nose. Mhm. Mm uh, does that look? No, I think that's good. Straight hair and wears a headband. Everything seems to check out. Let me just make a quick phone call real quick. 4258. 4258. No, don't hang up. 4258. 4258. There we go. Took three tries, but we did it. No answer. All right. That seems to be a good sign. Let me just make sure everything's correct on you. Raft Ellen. Raft Ellen. Capuchin. Hmm. Everything looks good. You're a housewife, right? Yeah, you are a housewife. All right. I think you're good to go. You can go in. Have a good day, ma'am. All right, we're still waiting on Francis, Albertsky, Alf, Roman, and Anastasia. There you are. You had a mole on your left eye last time. Um, ID, please. All right, let's see. Uh, all right, so the milkman is on the list. Let me just see. Uh, you're... Thing looks good. Let me just look at your appearance. Uh, I know you're the third floor. Long nose. Yep, that looks good. Thin chin. Mm-hmm. 
tired eyes, yep, short hair, and wears a hat. Yep, that looks good. The ID looks good. Let me check everything else. The date looks good. The logo looks good. Let me uh let me just make a quick phone call just to make sure. Four one two two. And then I'll check the ID in a minute. I just need to see what's going on here. No answer. Alright, that's a good sign. Let me just uh Check the ID. All right, so 2355, 2355, 6941, 6941, 8995, 8995. All right. I think you are good to go. All right, you can go in. All right, who's next? Alf, how you doing? You are on the list. So let me just look at your ID. Let me look at the ID first. So you're the last one. 1205. 1205 4809. 4809 6347. 6347. All right. The date looks good. The logo looks good. Let me just check your appearance. Big nose. Yep, that adds up. Prominent mustache. Mm hmm. Uses a monocle. Yep. Wears a hat. Mm hmm. And round face. Yep. Everything seems to check out. Let me just make sure the the name is spelled correctly. Yep. That's that's spelled correctly. Let me just. Uh, you come from your job as a lawyer. Let me check. Yep. You are a lawyer. All right. Let me just call up the number just in case. Four, two, five, eight. Yeah, don't you dare hang up. All right, let's see who it is. Hello, is your husband home? Not home, okay. That's a very good sign. All right, sir, let me just check your appearance real quick. I think I think everything's good to go. You can go in. Have a good day, sir. All right. Hopefully I didn't miss anything. Next, please. Hey, how you doing? Anastasia, you are on the list. Let me just see what's going on here. You come from the school. The date looks good. The logo looks good. Let me just check your ID number. 1326. 1326. 9853. 9853. 4462. 4462. All right. That's, that's good. You come from the school. All right. Let me check your appearance. Let me see. Uh, no, wait. Wrong, wrong floor. I want. No. Wrong floor. I want this one. There we go. So your ID, so your tired eyes, yep, that adds up. Two ponytails, yep. Small nose, yep, and round face. Is it me? Or does the chin look a little small? Oh, not the chin, the cheek, the, the, the lips, the lips. Do the lips look a little small? All right, where does that line up? Okay, that should line up with that. Nope, I I think that looks good. I think you are good to go. Let me just call up the number real quick just to be on the safe side. One, three, four, six. All right, call up the number just to make sure. Hello, is your daughter home? Not home, okay. That is a very good sign. All right. I think, I think you're good to go, ma'am. Let me just make sure there's nothing here. Wait, the hair, hold on. Does the hair look a little off? Nope, the hair's good. All right, you're good to go. Have a good one. All right, who's next? Hold 
Hold up. Didn't we just let you in? Oh. The logo's wrong. Can I... Let me just make a quick phone call. Hopefully we let the right one in. But... Here we go. We got another doppelganger. The logo was wrong. So we just got one. Alright. We caught another doppelganger. Let's go. Alright, we're still waiting on Roman and Albertski. Just two more people. How you doing, sir? Um, can I just see your ID? Thank you. Alright, so Roman Stiltski. The logo looks good. The date looks good. Alright. I'm a resident of the building. My apartment is the first room on the first floor. Stiltski. Let me just make sure everything's spelled right. Stiltski. Yep, that... That looks right. Let me just go in here. Um, 4839. 4839 2405. 2405 9684. 9684. Alright, so the ID is good to go. Let me check your appearance. So, big nose. Yep, that looks good. Scar on right chin. Right chin. Yep, that's good. Long face. Mm hmm. One eyebrow. Yep. Or a unibrow. And where's a hat? Okay, that checks out. Let me just call up the number real quick. One, one, five, two. Just to make sure. Hello, is your husband home? Not home. Okay, that's that's a very good sign for you, buddy. All right. The logo. Let me just check everything again. Let me just check your appearance. You you do wear a hat, so that's not anything to worry about. So. Okay. I think you are good to go. Have a good day, Roman. All right, now all we're waiting on is Albertski. Yeah. Did you just come back from an orchard or something? Because you got worms all over you. Let me just make a quick phone call. Actually, you know what? Let me question your appearance. Yes, worms. They're not worms. They're pimples. They look like worms to me. Let me make a quick phone call. We got him. We got him. I just figured I'd question him anyway. We caught one. Alright, let's see. Albertski, can we get the right one, please? Okay, this one does look normal. Can I just see your entry request? Alright. Let me just see. The logo on the ID looks right. The date looks right. The logo on there looks right. You come from your job as a shoemaker. Yep, that adds up. Let me just look at your ID real quick. 1465. 1465 1298. One two nine eight six three five four six three five four. All right, that that adds up. Let me just call up the number, real quick. Two six six eight. Two six six eight. Don't, don't hang up. Two six six eight. All right. Hello, is Albertski home? Your brother's not home. Okay, that's that's a very good sign. All right, let me just look at your appearance real quick. You're this one. Okay. So we got... Has a mustache. Yep, you have a mustache. Wait. Does your mustache look a little... No, I think, I think that's good. I think that's good. Prominent chin. Yep. Big nose, mm-hmm. I 
think I'm tripping. Does that look a little small? Let me see what that is. Huh. I think that looks good. I'm not sure. All right, big eyebrows. Yep. And long face. Mm hmm. Let me just look at your comparison. All right. That's where the nose is. Nope, I think you're good to go. I'm going to say you're good to go. All right, you can go in. And that's everybody on the list. Hopefully that was the end. Please be the end. Okay. With this one, the eyes are obviously smaller. I just let you in, buddy. I think I got the right one. Let me just make a quick phone call. They tried to throw an oddball at me. I, I'm pretty sure I let the right one in. Those eyes look pretty small. Yep, thank you. Alright, please be the last of them. Please. And thank you. There we go. Chester is back. Appeared safe and sound. Everything seems fine with Chester's health, but his family claims he appears quite disoriented and is babbling nonsense. Chester will be treated by professional doctors to rule out any brain damage. Okay. So, if somebody died, the news would have said something. But yeah, it looks like we're doing good so far. We're on day six. And with that, that's going to have to wrap it up for this episode. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.